classic mythical beasts have captured imaginations for centuries. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 creatures from Greek mythology. For this list, we'll be ranking the most well-known and best-loved creatures from the world of Greek myth. We're excluding the actual gods and goddesses from Mount Olympus, however, as we've already covered them in our video of the top 10 Greek gods and goddesses. He belongs in the underworld, not here. Number 10. The Sphinx Although most closely associated with the culture of ancient Egypt, this mythical creature was quickly adopted by the Greeks during the Bronze Age. Usually depicted with a human face, a lion's body, and the wings of an eagle, the Sphinx serves as a gatekeeper. Upon crossing the Sphinx's path, it challenges the traveler with the riddle, which creature walks on four legs in the morning, two in the afternoon, and three in the evening. Should the traveler not reply with the answer, mankind, he or she will immediately be swooped upon and devoured by the victorious Sphinx. It's a tough life in ancient Greece, huh? Number 9. Satyrs What's the matter, you never seen a satyr before? Uh, no. From the classic Federico Fellini film Satyricon to the Norwegian black metal band, references to satyrs are a dime a dozen. But in Greek myth, these creatures are classic troublemakers and revelers. The horse tails and ears. The most famous of their kind was Silenus, a close cohort of Dionysus and a character associated with fertility. Sometimes the figures would crop up in Greek plays with their very own genre, the satyr play, which took a usually dramatic story well known to the public and, you guessed it, made it satirical. It's not about the money, it's about the message, right? Wait a minute, whoa, whoa, you don't actually believe this crap, do you? Number 8. Chimera Shut down! It seems metal bands really like Greek mythological beasts. Chimera is yet another hybrid creature, this time a female that combines the physical traits of three separate animals, usually the body and head of a lion, with a second goat head and a snake's tail making up the rest. The earliest mention of the beast was in Homer's Iliad, which is where the physical description originated. The Chimera is also known to possess a terrible temper, as well as the ability to breathe deadly fire from her jaws at any who might oppose her bestial might. In other words, you might not want to get this one angry. Number 7. Medusa One of the most well-known creatures on our list, Medusa is the mightiest of a race called the Gorgons, who are snake-headed sorceresses with the power to turn men to stone with a single gaze. Many attempted to defeat her, hoping to gain the amassed gold and treasure in her lair. Myth tells of the hero Perseus finally beating her, which was later adapted for the screen in the Clash of the Titans films. Medusa has been portrayed in our time by such actresses as Uma Thurman, and appears in the video game worlds of the God of War and Castlevania franchises, which just goes to show her enduring legacy as an icon of evil. <laughs> Number 6. Cerberus This triple-headed guard dog is one of the fiercest and most frightening creatures from the world of Greek mythology, and with good reason. Cerberus is the gatekeeper of Hades, a hound of hell who prevents all lost souls from escaping the underworld. As if the three snarling maws weren't frightening enough, Cerberus has sometimes been described as having snakes emerging from his body, as well as a serpent for a tail, making this beast a dangerous foe from all angles. The only person ever to have tamed him was the hero Heracles, or the Roman Hercules. Number 5. Centaurs. The forest is not safe at this time. These hybrid creatures are instantly recognizable. The legendary race has the lower half of a horse. Yeah. The Minotaur. <laughs> this next hybrid has the head of a bull and quite the reputation. According to myth, the Minotaur was held in a labyrinth in the kingdom of Crete. Crete's king Minos pissed off the gods, and as a result, his wife was bewitched to fall for and lay with a bull, producing this enraged creature. 
The Minotaur would devour 14 Athenians each year, until Theseus succeeded in killing him, with help from Minos' daughter, Ariadne. <laughs> The dating image of the Minotaur carries on even now in video games like God of War and Vagrant Story, as well as in such films as Wrath of the Titans and Percy Jackson and the Olympians. He's that terrifying. Number 3. Cyclops Oh, you mighty Hercules! <laughs> This round-eyed race of giants was known for excellent building and crafting skills, and their overall nest. Polyphemus is the son of Poseidon, god of the sea, and a sea nymph known as Thusa. He holds the hero Odysseus and his crew hostage, devouring any man who attempts to escape. Men do not eat one another, Cyclops do. It isn't until Polyphemus falls asleep that Odysseus and his crew are able to blind the Cyclops and finally make their way from their island prison. Though to impale the son of a god proved not to be the best choice, as Poseidon kept Odysseus from getting home for a while. Number 2. Pegasus The most beautiful stallion in the world. Yes. This stark white and regal steed was actually birthed from the blood of the slain Medusa after her defeat at the hands of Perseus. Pegasus, a winged horse, would later be instrumental in the hero Bellerophon's defeat of the Chimera. He's made many appearances in pop culture, being seen in films like Fantasia, and his image has been used across several media, from a logo in World War II by UK parachute troops, to the old opening montage of TriStar Pictures. Today, Pegasus is famous in the God of War franchise as an ally of Kratos. Regardless of his origins, the use of Pegasus as an emblem demonstrates his legacy of beauty and wisdom. Before we unleash our greatest creature from the world of Greek mythology, here are some honorable mentions. Off one head, two more shall take its place. The name Hydra may be more familiar in recent times since it was adopted as the name for a terrorist organization in Marvel's universe. The Hydra, also called the Lernaean Hydra after its den of choice, was a multi headed water serpent that protected what was said to be a gateway to the underworld. As if that weren't bad enough, it was virtually impossible to decapitate the snake. After severing one head, two more would take its place. That doesn't sound good. Couple that with the Hydra's poisonous blood and venomous breath, and you essentially have a beast with almost limitless destructive potential, until Heracles came along. Do you agree with our list? Which creature of Greek myth did we miss? For more massive top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.